another simple tool that you have available to you, music. Music changes your state instantly, mm. right? And I had my playlist, Andrew, my exercise playlist, Patoranking Essentials on <laughs> iTunes. Hallelujah. Somebody at Apple went, hey, let's gather all the hits of all these artists and create playlists and, you know, so that people can enjoy them. And lo and behold, that's the thing I go to when I'm working out at home, right? I mean, now, now I'm out and about, you know, the, the curfew is lifted. We're obviously still masking and sanitizing, but I'm out and about more. But really, the power of music to, to alter your state, and music is really special because it alters your state immediately. Mm. It by, it's, it's like it bypasses the thinking mind. Yeah. yeah. Some of the tracks that really got me through the last 19 months were um, I, I really loved, um, you know, the album Beyonce released Lion King, The Gift. I really liked the song King already. Um, I think everybody needs to listen to the lyrics of that song, particularly men, actually, because she's talking to you in that song. It's quite interesting. Um, Good old Jay-Z and Kanye West, their album, Watch the Throne. I started, <laughs> I went back to that. I'm like, ooh, I haven't listened to this in a while. I really liked it. I would listen to that. Um, my daughter was watching Frozen and Moana. <laughs> so <laughs> I'd listen to those soundtracks and it was just fun being a kid again with her. Um, I really like Moana. It's um, The Rock. Uh, Dwayne Johnson plays uh, uh, this character called Maui, and it's just really funny because The Rock's voice is so um, distinct, and, and <laughs> you, you're, just, you're just thinking, this is so funny, that's The Rock, and he's singing, and he's singing really well, and my daughter and I will sing the tunes, and now when we're in the car, and you know, if I'm going shopping or to drop my dry cleaning or whatever, um, we'll listen to Frozen, we'll listen to Moana. I really enjoyed listening to, watching those those cartoons, the last 19 months, um, you know, Nas, Nas has, man, I tell you some creatives really took advantage of the downtime, quote unquote downtime. Nas, for example, released two albums and I've been playing it, playing them on repeat. Um, King's Disease, so deep, so deep. I said the last time we talked, Andrew, I, I love hip hop because of the storytelling. Mm -hmm. And there's some pretty amazing storytelling in there. And there's a particular song called Rare in King's Disease 2 um, that I, I just love. I love that song. Um, he seems like he's in a happy place. And I'm, I'm, I really, I, I'm drawn to people who, who seem to be happy. <laughs> um, but, but music is another really easy um, thing, resource to reach for, um, no matter how you're feeling. Um, yeah. Wow. <laughs> answer the question in a roundabout way but <laughs> no it's not a roundabout but it, it's very powerful and it seems you've uh you've sort of entered a part of my favorite uh, uh part where i like asking you know what are oh, three books three movies three songs <laughs> so you know since you've already started the with the song <laughs> no you... <laughs> no no but, but here's the thing gosh it's been so long when, when did we do the last interview was it two years ago I believe so, yes, yes. Wow, <laughs> that's another thing, Andrew. You know, that's another thing. It's time, like time is a bit skewed, right? Like mm. I'll find myself saying last year and I'll, I'll, what I really will mean is 2019. 2019. I was, I was contacting, <laughs> um, I was contacting a, a, a guy I know and he was like, well, yo, it's been two years. And I went, what? Has it been two years? A client of mine, an old client of mine contacted me. He wants to do some sessions. And I hung up the phone and, and, and I thought, holy moly, it's been two years since me and that guy have, have talked. But it doesn't seem like two years. So it's funny. Time, is, uh, time has become a bit, uh, a bit warped, right? True. Yeah, yeah. So uh, before we... But talk... carry on. And sorry for jumping ahead. But, but music really, you know, saved me. It always does. It always does. Yes. It saves a lot of people. That's why people listen to music in the car, you know? That's true. It just puts every, us in a certain mood. Everywhere we go, you know, there's there's music in the elevators, there's music in the mall, there's music in the public yeah. transportation. Okay, let me not assume. In Kenya, in our public transportation, yeah. we're very privileged to have music blaring 
as we go to work or wherever it is we're going to. So, yes. yes. So, uh, yeah, I guess let's uh, 